Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here once again. Back in the early days of the 21st century, a young Spark fund entered the electronics marketplace by selling components, a single components. But we quickly learned that for most folks, a single component wasn't enough. And let's face it, most projects require more than one component. So we started to put together kits. People seem to really like our early kits, like the SparkFun ProtoShield kit and the USB Bitwhacker kit. And of course, those led to what has become our flagship kit, the SIK, the SparkFun Inventors kit. Now, naturally, we're still releasing new components and products all the time, but we're always thinking, what would work well with this product? What other product could we combine? What would people use together? And every time that light bulb of an idea goes off, a new kit is born. I think you can see where I'm going with this. This week, we are, in fact, releasing a new kit. Let me introduce you to the new SparkFun Quick Open Log Kit. This kit gives you what you need to start creating your logging project. It includes a SparkFun Redboard Quick with one SparkFun Quick Open Log and an 8-channel SparkFun Quick Mux Breakout. To get you connected, there's a pair of Quick cables, one at 50 millimeters and one at 100 millimeters. We've also added a 0.8 meter reversible USB-A to USB-C cable. Yeah, that's right, it's impossible to plug this cable in upside down on either end. And of course, you've got to store that data somewhere, so we've thrown in a 32 gigabyte micro SD card with its adapter. Now this kit might look vaguely familiar. That's probably because less than two months ago, we released a very similar kit, the SparkFun OpenLog Artemis kit. Let's take a quick look at that while we're here, shall we? This kit utilizes the SparkFun OpenLog Artemis. Now, since this board has an Apollo 3 module, it can operate standalone without the need for a separate microcontroller. There's also an 8-channel SparkFun Quick Mux Breakout and a SparkFun Quick Scale so you have some data to log. There's a 1250 milliamp hour lithium ion battery to help your project go remote. And just like the other kit, there's all the necessary hookup and storage accessories. A pair of quick cables at 50 and 100 millimeters, the reversible USB-A to USB-C cable, and a 1 gigabyte micro SD card. While these two kits have their differences, the end goal of both is the same, to make it fast and easy to start logging sensor data. So take your pick. Do you need the portability and auto detection of the OpenLog Artemis kit? Or do you need the full R3 expandability of the Quick OpenLog kit? Either way, like my friend Andy Dufresne used to say in the yard, it comes down to a simple choice. Get busy logging or get busy dying. So start logging your data with either the SparkFun OpenLog Artemis kit or the SparkFun Quick OpenLog kit. Grab them both over at sparkfun.com. And until next time, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. Huh. Didn't take your out. Who knew? <laughs> Things like the Bitwhacker kit, USB Bitwhacker kit, the SIK, the SparkFun.